Hi, I'm Ian Yeo, CEO of Operants, uh, based here in C4DI. We were born um, just over five years ago now. Um, we were based originally downstairs in the co-working space, myself and Scott. We've gradually built up the company, so we moved from um, a smaller office and then we moved to another office and then today we're in this office five years on. So we formed originally to do consultancy work for primarily contractors and uh, large estate owners um, to deliver building information modelling support services for them. The business as we, we formed it was to try to work out from clients what their primary needs were. Okay, we always had the desire to provide software as a service to these clients based upon building information modeling. Um, so what we developed is an O&M piece of software. This takes models from clients. It takes um, say an architectural model or a structural model, analyzes those, and then it allows um, users to input data against that model. And so at the end of a project, when a building has been completed and delivered to a client, then they can access all their information using an app. They can see the latest information about the building, update that, always available to them. So, so one of the key areas that we've always seen is the ability to be able to um, track decisions um, throughout the life of a project. And so this is during the construction phase. So this ties in very closely with the problems that occurred with Grenfell um, and people not being aware of the changes to the cladding and items like this. So the government are bringing in legislation. It's the fire safety bill and the building safety bill. Um, and that requires um, owners of the building to understand exactly what's in their building, whether there's any changes in what's happening there. And so one of the key uses we have is um, we built it on uh, an immutable ledger. So it's a bit like the blockchain type approach. We understand exactly who's done what, when it's been changed and for what reason. And so that allows that golden thread through our product. It's been a great opportunity to be in C4DI. It's a great place to, to, to be, to start off with. So right from the time when we started downstairs, um, just the two of us, you had the people around you, you had different, um, you know, people that do marketing or people that will do uh, design. So they're all there available on hand. Um, so that, that support and then of course there's been the community around that, the events that are put on. So it's been, it's been fantastic from that point of view. But, but equally is the uh, ability to be able to move about this building. So as you grow the building, you know, it just grows with you, C4DI. Um, so, so yeah, it's been, it's been a great place to be. And of course the digital aspect as well. It's, it's been a really good time. The future, I mean, we, we see that the, the software we got um, producing and operating a maintenance manual for, the, for a building is just the very start. Um, once we've got that information uh, available to customers, um, we can provide enhanced services. You know, this could be sensors within buildings, so you know, um, you get feedback on users whether a building's being used efficiently. Um, there's there's uh, operating and maintenance of the building going on, so, so we already have uh, an FM app as well, so when all information is pulled together, it enables people to understand what maintenance they need to do at certain times and things to keep um, legal as well, so you're following the latest legislation. So there's loads and loads of opportunities that we see. Um, it's about providing those core services now and enhancing those as we move forward. But um, yeah, we see this is, uh, is a really good opportunity and, and the main thing is being the right software for our clients as well.